What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about character creation in the Elder Scrolls Online and how this has been something that really has been untouched by Zoss when it comes to updates and changes and uh, the things they've done over the years. Of course, the game's been out for seven years now on PC, six years uh, on console, and this is something that, like I said, has really gone untouched. And I think there could be some changes, whether it be minor changes or major changes come when it comes to how the character creation uh, kind of works in general a lot of people out there would like to see the option to be able to change your character's appearance in game with gold instead of having to buy you know things from the crown store to change your character's appearance or buy new hairstyles or whatever the case may be and that would be a nice addition i'm not sure if zoss would ever do that but i think they can definitely do some changes when it comes to the character creation screen itself we've had the same options like i said since the game was released i'm not sure if they thought the game would last as long as it has. I, I don't guess anyone really when they make a game thinks it's going to be as popular uh, six or seven years down the road as it was when it first came out or even more popular I guess when it comes to the uh, ESO. But I think there could be some different things they could add in here. When it comes to body types, when it comes to you know your height, your skin color, your body markings, all this stuff could really be reworked to make a more I guess kind of immersive experience when you're creating what you want your character to look like. And I think this is kind of an old system of course what you would see in some older style mmo or rpg style games and like i said that's kind of to be expected considering the game has been out for so long but they're always updating things they're always changing the way the game plays they're always you know fixing minor uh, ui things and you know some of the major things i know a lot of us would like to be fixed have not always uh, kind of had the attention that we would you know hope to see but overall, they're just making a lot of changes to the game. Now you have the option to play the game on an enhanced version on new-gen consoles. Of course, you know you can still play it on a, uh, you know, a really nice PC, and the game plays completely different, in my opinion, when I, I've seen it played on PC. It looks completely different than it does on, especially old-gen consoles. New-gen consoles is a little more, uh, I think, it's even the playing field a little bit. It's a little bit more like PC. But when it comes to just what we have for character creation in general. I think this could be updated for all platforms, whether you be on old gen or new gen. I think there could be a lot of options added in here to make your character uh, look and feel more like you want it to, I guess. Um, th just because what we have right now, it's hard to make a character that looks completely different than anyone else. Most people, you know, have polymorphs on or, you know, armor on or something to cover up with the way their character looks. Because most people's characters, if I look at all the characters I have in game, they pretty much all look the same if I take the helmet off or take the polymorph off. Uh, because it's hard to get a lot of detail with some of this uh, character creation. Like I said, that's to be expected considering the game has been out for such a long time now. I'm kind of curious, what do you guys think? What kind of options would you like to see when it comes to uh, character creation? Would you like to see more details and facial features or whatever the case may be? I'm kind of curious what you guys would like to have. I know this has been a uh, kind of a topic in the community off and on. Uh, for the last couple uh, years at least um, i've seen people kind of mention this here and they are wanting to have some changes to the character customization and i think it is something that needs to be looked at of course they need to look at the bigger problems first but when it comes to just updating the game and you know kind of freshening up some of the stuff that's been here for a while i think character creation is one place they could definitely start with some minor changes maybe to begin with and then some more major ones down the road Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. If you are a subscriber, make sure you uh, have the notifications turned on so you know when everything goes live here on the channel. And check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliate here on the channel, Empire Jerky. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.